Hey everybody, it's Adler the Eagle, and here's a look at what's coming up on this episode of Adler Animates. You just stop, drop, and roll, and roll, before the flames get out of control. Oh baby, you stop, drop, and roll. But first, funding for Adler Animates is provided by Nomad Complex, a premium apparel shop bringing you fashionable tees from Vancouver, Canada. Contributions by patrons through Patreon, and YouTube viewers like you. Thank you! Hey Blazin, do you know where the box is with all the like pots and pans and things in it? I can't find it. Uh, pots and pans are probably in the kitchen. Well, thanks, that's, that's very helpful. Oh, you know what? You're right, actually, it's right here. Oh, yeah. Oh. Just like I said. You know, you remember the last house, how we had a gas leak? Yeah, how could I forget? Well, I mean, that's actually got me thinking right now. It has you thinking? Oh my gosh, please, and there's a first time for everything. Ah, oh, gee, thanks. Well, like, for real though, that was actually a close call. Right, and in your sleep, you do this little thing where sometimes you snore and a little fire comes out. It's really cute. Yeah, but for real though, all it takes is one big snore and a boom, house is gone. Well, and us too, that's the important part. Us? Uh, no, 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 honey, it's just you. Just me? What do you, what, just me? Uh, hello, I'm a dragon. I'm fireproof. Oh, crap. Yeah. Oh, but wait. I actually have a tape about this. Uh, I have it packed away somewhere. Oh, hold on. Ah! Here it is. Be cool about fire safety. Yeah, they gave these to us in elementary school. It's actually a really cool tape. Well, let's put it in then, shall we? It's scary. According to the National Fire Protection Association, a home fire was reported every 93 seconds in 2019. A whopping 30% of these fires were started from cooking, which makes me very nervous to film Bargain Bird. That's why we always keep a fire extinguisher right off screen. Even with a fire extinguisher though, it's always a good idea to know just what to do if you ever find yourself on fire. I remember the first time I was on fire. I remember it like it was yesterday. I was at Midwest Fur Fest, dancing my heart out to Tech Fox's set. I was sweating and moving and grooving, when all at once, I realized that I'm made of felt, and this set was fire! I burst into flames, whoosh! But I didn't panic. Instead, I remembered to stop, drop, and roll. Soon I put the flames out. Quickly after, I got right back to dancing. So. The moral of the story is, if you ever catch on fire in public at a fursuit rave, just remember to stop, drop, and roll! Well, you were sitting bored at home and looking for something new. So you found a book of matches and you thought you'd play with one or two. Well, if you get that fire on you, I'll tell you what you gotta do. You just stop, drop, and roll, and roll Before the flames get out of control Oh baby, you stop, drop, and roll If putting out the fire's your goal Then just get onto the ground Roll yourself around You smother out the flames Before they can surround you If you stop, drop, and roll, drop and roll. Then you can leave the burning to the cold Roomba, Roomba. What, Rob? I would like to learn how to stop it, drop it, and roll it. Why would you want to learn? Do not question me, Roomba! Understood. 
but you cannot move on your own. I know my own limitations. I'm very good at step one. Stop it. Step one, success. We are 33.33333333333333. Percent complete. Commencing step two. Commencing step two! Step two! Silence! Silence! Rumbo! Apologies. My excitement settings were set much too high. Now lowering. Excitement now set to one. Yay. Step two. Drop it. Drop protocol activated. Roomba, wait. I'm... I'm scared. Recalculating. Step two. Success. Yay. Commencing step three. This is not what I had in mind, Roombo. Step three, success. Roombo, I am going to unplug your charging base. And now a word from a viewer like you. Hey everyone, it's Adler the Eagle. Oh, nope, wrong intro, sorry. Hey everyone, it's Samuel the Otter. Good to meet you all. I genuinely enjoy the content that Adler creates because I feel it embodies three main things that are fundamental to the fandom. Those things are creativity, charity, and community. Whether it's through charity live stream events or major events like Flappy New Year, the amount that Adler and Blazin and this community have generated for charity and the creative ways that they've done to do so to create this wholesome community is just really something special. And I want to support it by being a patron and will continue to be a patron for as long as I am able. If you're not already a patron, consider joining if you're able. And like we always say, help someone smile today. Goodbye. What would you do if you were on fire? I don't know, jump in a tub? No, you gotta stop, drop, and roll. Come on! If you clothes catch fire, you gotta drop to the ground. If your clothes catch fire, you gotta go round and round. You just stop, drop, and roll. Stop, drop, and roll. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I think it's eating the tape. Oh no, I forgot I could do that. I think I can fix it, but can you stop it really quick at the remote? Yeah. Stop! Oh! Like, stop, drop, and roll! Stop! Drop! And roll! <laughs> oh my gosh, I think I'm funny. <laughs> oh! Adler, I think it's fixed! Hey, Adler, hey, hey, I think it's fixed now, you can come out. Hey everybody, hey, it's Adler go? the Eagle, and thanks for watching Adler Animates. Make sure to help someone smile today, but first, what is your favorite way to use fire? To dispose of the evidence. <laughs> I mean barbecuing. Which is better, a gas stove or an electric stove? While both have their pros and cons, I prefer electric stoves. Do you like your house on the hotter side or the cooler side? I like it on the hot side, so when I'm home alone, I feel like I'm being hugged. 